Ugh. Well, nothing like a nice wake up call at 8 30 in the morning. My oh my. I am a tired Thomas, but I've had a package arrive and wake me up. Now, as soon as I see a package of this scale, my only thought and mention could be this has got to be from Razor. So let me read one word on the side. Whoa. Razor. Oh my goodness me, this package has just changed. It's now 12 o'clock. I'm starting this day productively and motivated because I've just got a phone call and a text off Nick from Razor. So shout out, just clarify, guys. I am sponsored by Razor, but this isn't a sponsored video because they just send me swag whenever, whenever, whenever. And I film every day of my life. So, do you know what's in this box? Okay, 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 okay. I don't, I don't, I don't want to get too excited, right? Too excited, but Nick from Razor said you should have received your new headset and potentially, maybe, wait for it, wait for it, please, 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 oh, that's a big box, this ladies and gentlemen might be my new laptop, oh, <laughs> Yes! Hey, right, this is the box I'm not used to getting my laptops in. So at first when I opened that, I was like, that's not exactly what I'm used to seeing when we get a Razer laptop. This is the box I'm used to seeing when we get a Razer laptop. This is the brand new. I don't actually know what it is, but we're going to take a look together. You ready? Oh, look at that. Lit. Oh, that is nice. Now, I'm going off to Shanghai. Uh, Tomorrow? I think we're off to Shanghai tomorrow. And whilst I'm going out there, I'm gonna be on a flight for like 14 hours. And ladies and gentlemen, I'm gonna have this brand new bad boy to be able to play with the entire time. So this is the brand new Razer laptop. And what's different about the, like the whole new laptops right now is they used to be like these dead, like, you know, like kind of curved edge sort of sleek design. And you've gone for more of a sharper look now. Oh, God damn it. Now I can't get it out. Take two. This is what I've gone for now. I've taken it out of the box. Look at it. So yeah, they've gone for this more of like a flat edge look to it, which, you know what? Personally, I think I preferred the older one, but at the end of the day, this laptop's more and new and improved. So I just, trying, trying to, right, try, try to do this one-handed with no nails does not help. Introducing my new Razer laptop. Where's the power button? Uh, wait, is that it? Did I turn it on? Oh, I did. I'm so used to the power button being there. It's actually been so long since I got a new laptop off Razer. Because I usually get like the new ones that come out earlier, but I didn't get this one earlier. So it's just like, I, they, I, they were like, do you need the laptop? And I was like, to be honest, not at the moment. Like my old one's fine. I don't, I don't need it, don't need it, don't need it. And then I was like, you know what? I could do with a new laptop at the moment. And then this one just came out. So mate, we, we rocking. Oh mate, that is a nice ass screen. Mate, we're rocking with 32 gig of RAM. We've got an i7 in it. What, gra what graphics card have we got? How do I don't find out what graphics card I've got? And some of you might be like, Tommy, it won't be that good because it's a laptop. Well, the whole point of this laptop is it's amazing for gaming. So let's take a look of what we've got inside. Just like that, we've got an RTX 2070. Oh my lordy. Which after a phone call to Raids uh, means that this laptop is actually called the Razorblade RTX 2070. That, that's the name of it. It goes Razer Blade and then whatever graphics cards in it. So uh, Razer, thanks for sending that out. Uh, uh, what game am I going to immediately play on it first? I don't actually know. I'm going to be on a flight for like 14 to 16 hours. So if you want to leave some suggestions of what I could play, I've got super fast internet here so I can just download loads of games onto it. But hey mate, if I'm just saying this right now. This, 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 this laptop might be cap capable of like sending satellites to space or something like that with its graphics cards and all that. But can it play? RuneScape. And as much as I love the laptop, guys, I'm going to have to push it to the side because that's nice. But do you know what's a better gift? This. Razer sent me a little pocketbook notebook thing. And I absolutely love it. I am a doodler. I, I don't know if I've got anything laying around right now. But yeah, like, look, 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 look. I'm a doodler. Anywhere I see a piece of paper, I get a pen and I doodle. It's like my number one way of being creative. So, Mr. Nicholas the Nicholas, thank you very much for sending me out the swag package. 12.35. Time for a little stream. All right then, that's what I call a successful morning. Got Bev round, she's cleaning the house, got a new laptop today, that's a win. And uh, just streamed a little bit of blackout. And I know uh, most of you guys have jobs and lives and you know, you've got stuff to do rather than at one o'clock in the afternoon be sat watching me. But I do a lot of daytime live streaming. Don't know why, just 
feel like doing it, pwned some noobs in some blackout and uh, just did it and got a 20 kill game in blackout. If you don't play Call of Duty or something, let me just say that's kind of a lot. So, you know, I'm not trying to say I'm like a big deal. I'm joking. Uh, I, I, I love that game. I'm absolutely addicted to it. I love playing it. And um, to be able to pull off stuff like that, you know, it shows that I'm improving and getting better at the game. <laughs> just makes me happy so right we're going down to the office we're going to meet up with karen we're going to meet up with alice and i think we're going to have a bit of a business talk and works of what we've got going on with syndicate original because we've got some nice things in the in the pipeline and more importantly we're getting some lunch I can smoke you in this thing i don't know what you're talking about mate oh, i do that yeah, just totally insulting your friend there <laughs> come and race me Stop it! What's wrong with racing? Not racing, Fine. So maybe my mum was not a fan of going drag racing in the Jag, which I totally wasn't going to do because that is not safe and not legal. Plus, I don't think you can drag race this because I'm pretty sure it's four-wheel drive anyway. So, she got us in nice and safely. And where are we? Limefield, where I usually bring my granddad for some food, but I'm taking my mother for some lunch. And I was going to bring Alice because that's usually what we do, go out as a company for lunch. But, um, yeah, Alice isn't here. She's uh, taken the day off. Thank, nice to see you working hard, Mum. Syndicateoriginal.com. Keep them in business. Link down below. Just love, like, local food and local... What? Can you have a, a what? No, you can't have a book for your birthday. By the way, it's my mum's birthday on Valentine's Day. I'm flying, I'm flying back from Shanghai just to get home for your birthday. Should I go for a wafer? Uh, yeah. <laughs> Thanks for that information, Mum. Oh, steak. Meat slap actually very tempted to pick up those lamb chops because they look good but have you got any pork chops pork chops pork chops pork chops oh. i was gonna say is that a pork chop but i'm not too sure wait feed me time you just knew i was gonna play with it well i only call it in one you're not finished yet your turn see you can't resist <laughs> no, construction shouldn't be pink should it construction shouldn't be pink well, oh sorry i didn't know we were color sexist. coordinated Racist. What's that? That, that's not sexist or racist. Thing. You're calling in a truck. Did you just assume that that truck's colour? How dare you? You are disgusting. You know what? I'm going to write a story about you that you put sweet corn on a potato. What do you have to say about that? No comment. No. <laughs> yeah, no comments. Always the best way. Oh, okay. This this is a problem right now. The cheese should be in the jacket therefore melting and then the tuna on top not the other way around but you know need some butter no Shh. butter not B butter um but yeah we have a problem so i'm gonna give this a rating out of 10. one joking about the zero out of 10 this is actually absolutely delicious and my mum's complaining she needed butter in her life you're such a str B -b blocking out the haters let's ask a different generation What's your favourite cereal? Like all time, like there's no, oh this or this, it's what is your favourite cereal? I'm going to go make some more, but my favourite cereal was called Puffer Puffer Rice. Yeah. Like sugar balls? No, it's hard to describe. Try. The tiny little cereal things, as big as Rice Krispies, yeah. but they were dead, it was um, dead smooth and had like a protein on it. It's hard to explain what it tasted like, but... You don't like Cadbury's mini eggs? Yeah. It's got that lovely taste around yeah. the outside. Yeah. It wasn't like the Cadbury mini egg taste, but it has such a distinctive taste. I've never... Really? That can anyone was... track those down and tweet me at them if you can find like a box we can buy online that are not like out of date? Puffer puffer around. But they're definitely out of date if they don't make them, but... Nah, I'm, I'm keeping this debate going. Chocolate shreddies are the best cereal ever. My mum has no, found a gift say, for yeah. me granddad. Kind of cute. Dear Grandad, from you to me. Okay, Mum, you can read. You've got a lovely reading voice. Here is a gift from me to you, for you to give to me. When we are children, we are always asking questions. Well, I now have some more for you. Please could you answer them in the way that only you know how and give the book back to me. There might be a couple of questions that you prefer not to answer, so don't worry. Just answer the others as well as you can. I want mine. People say that we all have at least one book in us, and this will be one of yours. The story of you and me that I will treasure forever. Thank you, we will. Oh, really nice. oh it just, it's just questions. Yeah. Oh, yeah, let's get that. That is such it's a good idea. a special day you had with my grandmother. I'd love to know more about my parents. What <laughs> can you tell me? Your mum's a knob. <laughs> yeah, let's get him. That's a really good idea, actually. Lovely dinner. Lovely. Um, glad to see you had a really good productive day at work, mum. I'm going now. 
Oh, at three o'clock. Yeah. Does anyone want a job? Because I think we're hiring. No, we're Aren't we? No, we're sacking. We're sacking? Yeah. Alice? Yeah. Why are we sacking Alice? And I'm going, oh, it's all right, love you, bye. Guys, keep my mum in business, syndicateoriginal.com. <laughs> Look in the description. See ya. Oh Lord, look at this. Bevla has been. The place looks nice and clean. Oh, Bevya. Bev, the legendary cleaner, has been and sorted out my ass. Look at that does not sound right. Sorted out my ass. No, house. She sorted out my house. Not my ass. Oh, look at this. She's wiped down the surfaces, looking all nice and clean. She's hoovered the floor. Uh, yeah, um, she's hoovered the floor to an extent, because you know. You can't really get past these cables, can you? <laughs> but it's time to continue a live stream. I was playing for an hour earlier. Got an epic 20 game win. Um, and then I have to go out for dinner with my mum. But I reckon we should, we should carry on playing again. I take it back. We're at the pub. And I'm here to see it. No way. My dad, Tom and Alex. I haven't seen them in ages. <laughs> oh, yeah, we drink. You're right, strangers. Oh, yeah, oh, yeah, I was going to say, have you been riding? <laughs> what was the point in asking that question? <laughs> That's it, bro. <laughs> where, 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 where you going with my keys there, mate? What, what are you doing? What are you doing? Oh, yeah, I didn't know you hadn't seen it. It's nice looking. It's mean looking. Ooh. It's got a nice mean Ooh. looking front. It could do with a spoiler on the back like a Project 8. Orion, just for context, put the Project 8, search uh, Jaguar Project 8 here on the screen. It needs to look more like this with a spoiler on it because um, it's basically that, but a sport edition. But even sportier. Wait, wait what did you just say? You want one? Mate, Jaguar, I, I like the car, but I didn't know what everyone else would think about the car, but everyone seems to love it. It does look mean, doesn't it? Wait until you see the SBR, man. Wait until you see it. Of which I just had a call with Jaguar today, and it's looking like when I get back from Shanghai, the week after that, I should get the Jaguar SBR. And I told him, I was like, listen, there's not just pressure on me anymore. Everyone was always asking me like, Tom, when are you getting the car? When are you getting the car? When are you getting the car? It's now on Jaguar because everyone's now expecting it. In you go. Boop. So Jaguar, I'm waiting. I have a question for you, right? I'm going to go around the table. The question is, what is the world's best cereal? Think about it. Yeah, you win a Jaguar. If you say the, if, if you can guess mine, you can have the Jaguar for a day. All right. Oh, please don't tell me you've seen it. You might have seen it. I don't know. What is the world's best cereal? I'd say either golden nuggets Ooh. or cookie crisps. Ooh. Ooh. Yeah. No. On my level. I like golden nuggets, but no. Cookie crisps. How is cookie crisp on the list, you freak? Go on. Your, fav your favorite all time cereal. The best cereal in the world. I don't really eat cereal sometimes. <laughs> they just say Cheerios or something. No, I don't like Cheerios. No, well, you've got an opinion. We'll come back to you, Dad. I, I know what yours should be. Come on. 20 weight with loads of sugar on What? Really? <laughs> I never I would have thought you would have said fruit and fibre. Porridge. <laughs> Anything? Chocolate rice crispies. Chocolate rice crispies. Yeah. Wrong, wrong, wrong. I did my, I did my chocolate, chocolate shreddies. Oh. The best. Oh, yeah, wrong, 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 wrong. It's like no, a reunion of bikers who don't ride. <laughs> <laughs> it's exactly no, that. We just like dress we just like dressing on white bikers, yeah. I'm gonna get this out of the way now. What's your favourite cereal? All time favourite cereal. And if you get it right, you get fries. If you get the If you match what mine is. Yeah, yeah. All time favourite. Like you crave it. You're like, oh, I've got to have it. I want to hit it Alpen. Alpen. Don't say crunchy nut. Close. Chocolate shreddies. Oh, fuck off. Come here. No mud. No mud. No mud. Cheers. It's chat. Good to see you. Good to see you. Good to see you. He works at Jet too now. I'm watching at the airport one day. That'd be amazing. Do I get cheap flights? No, I did right. Good for, good for nothing, friends. Jesus Christ. Fuck it. Bitch. <laughs> I'm trying to concentrate. I scared the living shit out of him. <laughs> Getting ready to stream and what? What? Wait! What? what are you doing? What? What are you doing, Steve? So. Ooh. Oh no! 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 No!
I am so fed up with Stephen being locked in that cage. I tell you what, when you get back, we're going to move you over there in from downstairs to upstairs so I can see you more. Honestly, him being down in the basement was such a good idea and it made so much sense. But the thing is, he's always down there and I don't really use the basement all that often. And because Carl's not been in the last week, he's got no one to talk to. Like, yeah, you could say I'm here, but I'm always in my office, aren't I? So I think it's about time we move Steve upstairs. I can't put him in the office, but I could put him in the spare bedroom or something. But look at him, he's out of his vivarium and he's like, I love life. He's such a better colour when I get him out. I don't know why he just hates his vivarium. Like, don't get me wrong, you could say there's no room for him to walk in, but... That's a pretty normal tank for a big size, beard, like an adult size bearded dragon. It's just that he just, he just doesn't really choose to walk far, do you? And when I put him down on the ground, he just walks into a corner and sits there. What are you looking at? Was that? Did he just do a run? Why do you keep randomly moving his head sideways? Oh, he's so cute, isn't he? He's a big dude now, though. Look at him. He's a big dude now. Look at the size of him. Steven, this is Steve Cam. Legend. <laughs> <laughs> I love him. Steve's taking over the world. Look at my live stream. I've just got my camera pointed at Steve, but look how good the quality is. <laughs> look, if I make this full screen, it's just Steve. <laughs> That's all I'm live streaming right now. Steve, you enjoy that, mate. <laughs> look how big my hand is on camera. <laughs> I love him. I'm so glad Carl's back playing Blackout with me. Why? Because um, he, he only went and team killed me, which uh, was was a really nice thing of him to do. So thanks for that. But let me just go on over here. You know, I always talk about Twitch, which is like my favorite thing to do. Like I loved making videos of me gaming and stuff like that. But I so much prefer streaming. And it's just such a fun thing to do. And it's been amazing recently. Like, especially like being able to just stream all day, have a Ryan edit the gaming videos for Royale channel, edit the vlogs. It just gives me more time to have fun. And it's clearly showing because whilst I'm streaming over it, look at the chat going hype, right? If I go over to this, let me just scroll down. Every time I stream right now, everyone is going mad with the gifted subscriptions. Aaron has gifted like 20 subs to the channel. He donated $129 for some reason and just said, I love everything you're about and I've been a fan for a long time. And I'm like, that is absolutely insane. M Music Addict donated 10 subscribers and then donated another 10 subscribers. Then Aaron Dana donated 10 subscribers. And now I'm just like, what the hell is going on? If you are one of the people who tune into my Twitch streams and just watch in general, thank you. And if you are one of the mad people out there gifting subscriptions, all I can do is say thank you for supporting the community. You're a legend. I blinked and then all of a sudden Genk is in here with the subscriptions. What the heck is going on? What's wrong with you? I guarantee I've got that off you now. I would have put my hazmat suit on and a mask and, and, and give you tissues and lemon, lemon and honey. I won't touch you. Fist bump. I love you. Have a great I love you too. Oh yeah, I'll see you when I, I might. I might see you tomorrow before I go. I doubt it now. Bye bye. Carl, if you're watching this, you had one job. One job, mate. And that was not to set my house alarm off. I shut the door. On. Care to explain? Care to explain? I tell you what, you you're ill. You just go. I'll set the alarm. All right. Ten out of ten for effort. Okay? I know what I'm doing. Oh, of course. Second time now. Second time. Love you too, bud. Get well soon. We even just joked on stream then being like, don't set the alarm off. And he's like, nah, I won't. I'll make sure I lock the door properly. Do it, Craig! Wrapping up the stream now. It's currently nearly one o'clock in the morning. That was the last... Oh, no, no, no. I was going to say that was the last stream before I go to Shanghai, but it's not. It's not at all. Um, let me just show you what my Twitch chat's doing right now. They're playing Bop It. Yeah, they're playing Bop It in the chat. So let me show you. Right, so everyone's saying hi, vlog, and goodbye right now, but and they're showing up the love hearts and all this, but uh, they were... Oh, hang on a minute. You can't avoid anything, chat. I'll just scroll up. Yeah, look at this. What? What is this? My entire Twitch chat was just playing Bop It. I don't know why they were. They're just absolute strangers. hell. Oh, there we go. We're, they're playing Bop It again. I didn't tell them to, but they're still doing it. So, ladies and gentlemen, my Twitch chat. It's one o'clock in the morning. And I'm in the drive through do 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 got my seat while my toast in mm, 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 mm. my buttocks too do 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 oh whoa I noticed that as it heats up you see it actually getting redder wow also there's like four police interceptors the ones that chase down cars in that parking lot behind me I pulled in and I was like ooh there's a crew of people here and then I got closer and I was like 
that's not a crew of people I ever want to see in my rearview mirror. No, 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 no. So I'm going to get the McDonald's. I'm going to nibble a little bit of it. I'm going to drive home. That's the plan. Because I am starving. And do you know what I got from McDonald's? Do you want to know what I ordered? Five large chicken select meal. Five large chicken select meal. Five large chicken select meal. Five, 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 five. Wait, I didn't even get large. Shit. Damn it. Oh, they are not the people I want to mess with. There's an entire squad of them out. What the heck? Oh, wow. Oh, that was scary. You know, like when you see me in your rear view mirror, I'm like, hell to the motherfucking no. The like sharks. Is it gone any redder? Oh, what the heck? It's oh, I turned my engine off because um, I'm in a park stationary vehicle on my phone. Yep. Take that. Being legal. I, I'm not a fan of people being on the, in their car driving on the phone. Like, not at all. I shout at people. If I'm on my pedal bike and I see people doing it, I'm like, nah! Shouting at them. I give them the, I give them the whoosh, whack over the head. Just like to clarify to any police officers, I do not assault anyone in any vehicles on their mobile phones. I wish I could do, because they're not teaching them a lesson, but I don't. So I drove on home, I had my McDonald's, and then you know what? I went to bed. Because that's what responsible adults do. I didn't stay up till, like... 4 a.m. watching YouTube RuneScape videos. What are you talking? What are you talking about, you weirdos? I don't do that. But uh, it's now the next day. Uh, my McDonald's was uh, uh, lovely, you know, because like when you go late at night and you order, and it's like they have to cook it fresh because they've got none ready. Oh my god, the chips were nice. They were salty. The food tasted good. The chicken salix tasted good. The only thing I will say is I had a uh, mozzarella dippers, the kind of thing, cheesy sticks. Yeah, um, not that good. No, they, they, I, well. It's probably because I forgot about them, left them in the bag. And then when I looked in the bag and they were there, I was like, oh, mozzarella dippers. Uh, but then the cheese went hard. So, yeah, that was a bit of a strange kind of tasting experience. But nonetheless, that ends another beautiful vlog for you guys' faces. Every day, 6 p.m. for your faces. Now, let me say this right now. This is the public service announcement of I am going to China. China bans a lot of websites. But because I upload my files to Dropbox, I should be able to... Possibly still access Dropbox, upload the files there, get around to take care of the video, and then remotely upload the video to the main channel. Whoa. There's horses just galloping around. That's so cute. So basically what I'm trying to say is I should be able to try and get the vlog still uploaded. No problem whatsoever. If there does end up being a problem, we'll try and buffer it out within the first day. And obviously the biggest thing is the time difference. Now, I get to China tomorrow and I go ahead in time and all this this sort of stuff so when this vlog goes live I'm not too sure what time tomorrow's vlog's gonna go up you know just because I'm traveling I'm literally going into the future I eight hours ahead but I'll be on like a crazy like 16 hour flight or something so um, if this vlog tomorrow is late that's just because I was traveling and that's the one reasonable excuse to say the daily vlog was late or something but I'll see you guys tomorrow um, for a, um, a travel vlog which is gonna be me flying on a plane where I've never been before. And I don't think I've ever flown with this airline before as well, so it should be a fun experience for all of us. Like, you guys seem to love the flying vlog, so let's see how the hell that pans out. But I'm gonna go now. I love you, I'll leave you. Click the follow button on my Twitter. <laughs> Click the subscribe button here on YouTube and you'll see a little bell appear next to it. Ding that bell and you'll hopefully never miss a video when I upload it. So until then, much love. Follow me on Instagram, at Syndicate, because I'm going to be posting loads of stories over there and keeping you guys updated with what I'm doing. And I will see you on another dawn on another day. Goodbye. Sarios.